I think it was clearly 90 percent what the Times and the Journal said, which is the labor market's tightening. Get, they want to reduce the turnover of their workforce. They want to get better workers. This is the way pure, it should work. Purely, yeah. It's capitalism. Right. I knew you'd agree. Which, which, is capitalism, beautiful, right. which is a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. It's a purely commercial beautiful thing. He says beautiful thing. I know he you hate it. Yeah. We agree. <laughs> right. uh, a purely commercial thing. But I think there is a little bit of PR involved that Walmart wants to have a better image, and this is a way to have a better image and hopefully get some more people in the And stores. Walmart also endorsed the employer mandate on Obamacare. I mean, they tend to do a lot of shrewd moves that are good politics for them. I don't think this should be viewed as a proxy or a vindication or validation for those who think we need a national minimum wage increase. Does it this slow is, down? Sorry? Does it, does it slow down that movement? Oh, no. I think actually there's, there's, a, there's an advocacy group in the Walmart uh, workers community that's arguing for even higher minimum wage. The, number, the dollar needs to be higher for minimum wage and in, min, and in states across the country. So I think there are some that are going to use this as this is just the beginning. We need to get going. And I just think we need to isolate this as a Walmart decision and not a basis Steve, upon do, which do, to make do, a do national policy. Do you think Democrats policy. say, oh, look, the, the market's working? Or do you think Democrats no. say Demo the market's not working at all no. and this is an example no, of what they, we but, should... No, the markets say we still need an increase in the minimum wage. It's all well and good that Walmart did that, but we still have millions of minimum wage exactly. workers in this country. What struck me in one of the papers today was a map that showed the states that have higher minimum wages than the federal and there really are an increasing number. This is another issue where the states are kind of ahead of Washington That's in terms fine. of, it, of, it, of it'd be moving also, this up. It would be nice if we got a 4% economy where everybody suddenly was above the minimum wage and it was just antiquated. And all of a sudden, it, it, that the labor market got strong enough to where the growth just caused companies to pay more on their own. It's a great theory. I'm not sure it's ever know, happened in practice. Companies are evil and they try to hold their workers mm. down, Steve. I understand that. They're, they're capitalists. Uh, they're, and there's they're, nothing they're wrong with capitalism. Capitalists. Hey YouTube fans, I'm Landon Downey from CNBC. Thank you so much for checking out our channel. You can subscribe by clicking right here to check out the latest Mad Money CEO interviews, market news, financial advice, and product unboxing. Enjoy! Mm -hmm.